What's going on everybody? So I'm back to the video. Hope everyone's having a great day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys this cool hidden iPhone feature that a lot of people didn't actually know. So I actually found about this probably a couple of days ago. So I'm going to leave the link down below in the description to the article that I found this on. So basically you guys can scan documents straight from your iPhone. So this is extremely useful if you're currently working from home and you got to send your coworker some sort of document. Also, if you're like a student right now and you got to scan a document uh, or like a, some sort of assignment or project that you got to hand in. Um, this is also very useful because you guys can just literally take a picture of your uh, current assignment and then hand it in. Uh, usually what I had to do like a long time ago was like go to the library, scan it through there, hand it in. And obviously um, that was a hassle of doing that every single time. Um, also, there's another way of doing it where you guys can download like third party applications from the app store. But now it is built in the iOS 15 software. So uh, the first thing you guys want to do basically is or the, or the first method is to go to your notes application right here. And you basically just want to long press the application. And then now you have the ability to scan documents. So that's the first method of doing it. Um, you also can access it by if you have the notes app in your control center. So we long press again and then you have the option to scan document. Um, other applications um, this has uh, this feature in is Google Drive and the files application. So I'm gonna show you guys the files real quick. So when you're in the files application, all you need to do is click on the upper hand corner with the three little dots, and then you have the ability to scan documents, and then obviously grab your document. I just have this um, shelf uh, manual that I had a couple days ago. So you would just scan it or take a picture of it basically. So. Uh, I'll do that real quick. So here's the image I did take. So if you want to crop it or kind of fix it up a bit, you do have the option to do that. Or you also have the ability to retake the photo as well. But from there, you guys are going to be able to send it to wherever you want through email or if you want to like airdrop it to your Mac, you're going to be able to do that. So uh, very quick video. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. If you guys did drop a like on the video, hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys never miss a video. Let me know down below in the comment sections what do you use the scan a document feature for. Um, I mainly use this obviously for cause school because I'm still in school right now so for assignments so this is going to be extremely useful for me um, in my last semester but yeah guys that's basically it and I'll see you guys in the next one.